Our brains are wired to ensure that we will repeat life-sustaining activities. It does this by releasing dopamine. Dopamine is the, hey, that's fantastic, we should do this again, neurotransmitter. Back in the primitive days, our brains would have been bursting with dopamine when we found and ate food, found shelter, had sex, and ran away from the saber-toothed tiger. All things that helped us survive. Now, in present day, when activated at normal levels, this reward system rewards our natural behaviors. Overstimulating this system, however, produces euphoric effects. Alcohol and other drugs can release two to ten times the amount of dopamine that natural rewards such as eating and sex do. This can happen almost immediately and last longer than any of the natural rewards we may receive. So where our brains would have been, wow, this is fantastic, after we have a delicious meal, if we were to smoke marijuana, our brains would be like, whoa, this is so fantastic. And that feeling would last a lot longer than our post-meal bliss. We can start to understand how our very own brain can reinforce alcohol and other drug use.